having a live demonstration. It's a special day for us. It's the first time we do a uh, material processing live demonstration in a trade show. So I'm a little bit stressed, actually. But everything should work super fine. So we come from telecommunication. We have adapted the technology for material processing in the last few years, successfully in microprocessing, in additive manufacturing, and in welding. And today we will be performing a welding demonstration. We have picked up the topic of immobility uh, because it's a fast grain market, but because it's also an important topic. Climate change is an important topic. And if Kai Labs, we can contribute just a little bit to that, that would be uh, an achievement for us. So the demonstration will actually happen in France. So we will connect with France now. So France, are you hearing me? We will be connected with Yancy Tomeparty. Yeah, great. So can you hear me, Julien David? Hi, Gwen. Yes, uh, we can hear you well. Uh, so yes, I'm right now uh, live from the Institut Maupertuis with David Lemaitre, which is technical director of the, of the Institute. Hi, David. Thanks for, yeah, thanks, thanks for hosting the, the event. OK, super cool. So actually, Julien will be explaining what they have over there. I will cut my mic and my video so that it's full screen. Julien, the floor is yours. Thank you, Gwen. Um, so yes, we are here at the Institut Maupertuis to realize a welding test campaign using our beam shaping laser head, which has been specifically uh, um, developed for copper welding. As you probably know, if you are attending this, uh, this live demonstration, copper is a very interesting but challenging topic when we talk about, about um, laser beam welding. Uh, I can testify because I, I, I've been working on this subject uh, since the beginning of my internship at Kai Labs now more than two years ago. And the Kylabs team has been, uh, has been developing prototypes and products for one year now. So um, we are about to launch the, the welding process. But just before, I invite, you, I, I invite you sorry, to come with me into the cabin to show you the setup that we are using uh, to do this test. Okay, so we are now into the cabin. Here is the laser head that has been developed by Kylabs which is integrating uh, Precitec collimating and focusing units. The laser head is now integrated on a robot arm and, li and linked to an 8 kilowatt um, Trumpf laser. Here is the part which is about to be welded. So the use case that we are studying uh, today is battery bus bar welding. So to do so, we are using an ETP copper. Uh, so uh, in, a, in a, an overlap welding uh, configuration, so you can see here um, the base plate, which is a two millimeter copper plate, uh, two millimeter thickness, sorry. Uh, on top of which we will uh, weld four uh, other plates, thinner plates to, to be representative of car battery welding and a thicker plate here, which is more representative um, of uh, trucks uh, battery welding. So it's now time to, for me to leave the cabin uh, turn on the laser and do some, some welding process. Okay, so um, as I said, this, um, this beam shaping laser head has been specifically developed to do uh, copper welding. So the beam shape that is realized is composed of a central uh, intense dot to ensure uh, sufficient penetration and initiate the keyhole. And this central intense dot is surrounded by a ring. This ring uh, aims at preheating the welding zone, increasing the uh, absorption of, uh, of copper. And, um, oh, okay, so it seems that the laser, okay, the laser is on. Okay, so it seems that we, we've had a, a little issue with the, with the laser. We'll maybe go, go back again. So yeah, to continue my, my explanation on the on the, the laser beam shape, um, the okay. So we back again. This is the risk of doing a live demonstration. Sorry about that. So here is the here is the welding. So to, to finish, sorry, my my explanation on the beam shape, um, the central dot is surrounded by an outer ring, which aims at um, preheating the welding zone and then increase the absorption of copper at one micron wavelength, and, uh, and also uh, aiming at, um, at um, stabilizing the keyhole. 
So now I let the I let I give the floor to Gwen, letting me the time to, for going going back into the cabin and um, and take out the the samples. Okay. I have three stuff to say. Let's say if I don't forget anything. First one, I have bus bar with me. Who want to have some bus bars and have a look at the wells? My sales team is supposed to be around. Yeah, yes, yeah. great. Thibaut, yeah. Chipen, they have the bus bars. You want one? Okay. All right. So you can have them around. The system we were demonstrating just now is actually compatible with every laser brand. And it has already demonstrated that it's working with scanners. So just to let you know. And while actually Julien is unmounting everything, we can have a quick look at what we got actually with those wells. So the video will be playing on the screen uh, in loop afterwards, so you can see it later on. Just to say that we did the macrographics of those uh, best bars. So the well is like of good quality, no pores, no spiders. Uh, the penetration depth on the trap ones, so the thicker one, the two millimeter one, was 0.8 millimeter inside the second material. And what we got in the other one, okay, that is uh, the carbus bar, the, uh, the thin uh, one of one millimeter and the, the penetration was 0.8 millimeter. You also can see that it's not uh, bonded with the same laser power. Okay, so Julien, are you good? Okay, so you can now... Okay. The sample uh, that has been welded. So as you can see, we have a pretty regular weld team. Uh, not that much, not, not, no, with, I mean, we, we can see no spatters and, and uh, the welding seems to be pretty solid in order to be compliant with the industry requirements. Okay, so now uh, I will go out of, 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 the, of the cabin. Okay, so this is okay. a okay. demonstration. Julia, you're here? Yes, okay. yes, we can, we can hear you. Okay, super cool. Uh, if you have some questions, I guess the best is that uh, you reach the sales team, say hi again to the sales team, where are you? They are around, Tiffany, Thibault. Okay, look for them if you have any questions. There is also the technical team there if you have some question. And now I want to thank the whole team in Labs who helped for that. Adrien, Joseph, Clementine, uh, the technical team for the laser head. Uh, the Institute of Pertuis, of course. Julien, thank you. Yeah, thank you, Gwen. It was a pleasure uh, for us uh, to do this live demonstration. And, and, uh, and you, you can, who, can you see the whole people just there? Okay. <laughs> thank you all. Enjoy the Prosecco, enjoy the food now. Thank <laughs> you.